Okay, welcome back. I think... I think everything is working properly now. Won't know unless someone types a comment. Anyhow, let's get back into Stormvale Castle. Since we're here, we might as well get the Chrysalis Memento. But we don't really have to. Now there's a spot up here which uh, frustrates me to no end when uh, I see casuals not going for it. Since uh, it's just free upgrade materials. You know, grab your stuff. Plus you can skip the bird. Absolutely brilliant. Do that. Do that next time. Uh, unless, you know, you don't want, you want to pick up upgrade materials because hey, no, they're useless to us. Absolutely busted Ash of War. I swear. Disgusts me. chug a bit. Best to play it safe. We will get to see. What about the lantern? It's because we do not fear the banished knight. A cheeky backstab. Do not fear the banished knight. Now, since we're here with all these fire pots, we could have put on the, the flame trick talisman. Oh well. Not a huge issue. And of course, even though it's a it's a minor difference, popping on the um, you know the plus ten levels worth of stats does give you flat defenses, so you know, if you're in a, in a tight fight, you might as well pop it, even if it doesn't give you uh, relevant stats, so to speak. We can come in here and grab all the stuff later. We don't really need it. Uh, we will pick up the placebo feet, though. We will ignore the Spanish Knight, though he does drop the good loot. It's always a pain uh, if you mess it up. So, we'll come back for it. Alright. Now we're going to get our most important sidearm.
remember that the shortest pathway is always to jump just like um, what's it called we can do that we can even do this if we aim just right ta-da and if you do this you can actually get done into the pit um, easily we're not going to do that though not about that at the moment just a little just a neat little uh, quote unquote speed running trick that I want everyone to uh, memorize All right, there's some enemies in here so we're going to pop this Stack it going. There we go. The Iron Wet Blade. Hot Crest Windshield. And our beloved Misery Cord. Misery Cord. Call it the Power Cord because uh, it is it is our most important tool. In fact, we're going to slap it right on. There. So you get this nice little shortcut, we can uh, go grab the short to cot, and then the crystal is memento. It is easy as that, my friends. Easy as that. Elden Ring is an easy game. You gotta, you gotta keep that in mind. In fact, we could even challenge this. Uh... I said challenge, I didn't say B. Is constant aggression. Do we have blue juice? Okay, we'll get blue juice. I screwed that up. Well, that's why you get the shortcut. Once again, we will not speak of this. We'll speak of this to no one. But yeah, this is this is basically castle skip. You know, there used to be capital skip. Well, this is castle skip. Did you think this is an overpowered Ash of War? I think so. Spamming it gets you re rewarded. Anywho, let's grab the next Grace. 
Actually, we can also grab something else while we're here. Actually, we will not grab it. I will show you the way. I will show you the way. We're going to grab the grace. Then I will show you the way. We're supposed to. I guess we could go get the Stormhawk. Painting. I'm going to grab this grace and sit on it. Actually, we're not going to sit on it. Oops. Oh, we got the elevator. We got the grace. Suicide is a viable tactic. To die as often as one pleases. Ain't that right? And hesitation is defeat. Blah, blah, blah. Okay, I will show you the way. All right, you don't, you don't go through the courtyard. Going through the courtyard is a mistake. Only a fool does that. And we're not fools here. What we are, however, are extremely clever. And by extremely clever, I mean, you know, everybody should know this. Uh, I guess we could go grab the, the stuff that's up here first. Straight up executing them with one hit. And no upgrade. And the range, the forward momentum. Disgusting. But this is why we're using sheath. Although we have our sidearm now, we should prep that. Law Talisman, we can throw this on for the next boss fight if we so desire. 10% boost isn't much, but jump attacks two-handed with the katana do a good amount of Sager poise damage. So, highly recommended. It is a tool that you ought to use in your arsenal. Okay, there's an annoying bird here. You gotta watch out for the annoying bird. number of hosts I've seen die to that is it's horrible. Absolutely horrible. Okay, this is the skip. This is the way this is the way you should be doing it, right? You wanna go get the important things, we go down here. Keep that in mind. Oh gosh. Doesn't kill them on one hit. Rats OP. You really do not have a lot of health as a, as a prophet, but this is what we're here for. This is what this is what we're waiting for, boys. God slayer seal, occasionally useful. God's good prayer book, constantly useful. Black flame melts bosses. And we will be using it extensively. To not do so is a sin. All right. Um, Okay, let's go talk. Let's go talk to uh, Heartbroken Maiden. We don't have to. 
this is optional. We could have just skipped the castle and gotten the golden seed here and everything, but look, we're 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 doing a bit of the story here, right? Right. Give her depression for optimal gameplay. And then rest up. That should drop. Actually, if you if you leave to Liurnia, then she will drop the seed here. But since she went to the Round Table Hall, you have to go talk to her. So this is not the most efficient method. I'll be honest. But uh, we can get the Red Hood. That'll boost our, our vigor by a small margin, if we so desire. Or we can just keep playing this uh, blindfold. Lovely. See? Um, what fact do you... Ah, tomboy appreciator. Okay, in order to, for her to drop the red hood, we actually have to get her to move over here. So we will talk to our best friend. Um, we'll put Ashes of War, Azericord, Flame of the Red Maids. That is, actually, we'll do a Flame Art. See, this is why we grab the uh, whetstone, don't we? Look at those bonuses. That's uh, actually, it's actually worse. It's actually unironically worse. Maybe if we put, maybe if we've drunk our flask, whatever, we'll keep it on fire for now. But yeah, we've got our piece. It's all the fireballs we need to be spitting. We will get on with our business. Oh wait. Did we talk to him? Did we talk to Hugh about Roderica? Roderica, there we go. Okay, let's go talk. Right you are, right you are. All right, I think we just have to rest or port back. That should prep it. Looks like it's done. Rodrigo, the spear tuner at your service and we will need her help. But we will not tune yet. Although we have the rotten dog, we will not use it yet. Let's um, let's go back to the rampart tower. Pick up the hood. It's not necessary, but you know, we're still at seven level seven, so we might as well. We'll uh, keep our peace on us for protection. Trust me on this. for damage they staggered instantly though that's the that's the true power of the dagger okay look how much health we got from that almost nothing all right well now that we have the left side chamber we're gonna beeline it for the last set of grace we could always you know go kill the uh the tree spirit um but I don't think we are. Oh, and remember to drink your flask for those flat defenses, right? 
Uh, we will use the katana for these birds if we have to fight them. Since Having, a, having a, a Kevin moment here. That's the danger of the uh, the unsheathed Ash of War is uh, you actually lose IQ in debuff. But not to worry. While we're here, we can go talk to our friendo, who we will not be killing. Thank you very much. Let's uh, grab the upgrade material that we once again won't use. Okay. Nefeli Lu, how many people missed you in their first playthroughs? But she will give you the uh, the base version of the arsenal charm, which you know it's kind of useless, but that shouldn't stop us. I think we have no uh, unfinished business that needs to get done, so I guess we'll just uh, beat the boss here. Pot and strike to put in some work here. Actually, let's go get those pots first. Because we can. And upgrade our flask. Because we can. Drum color, not a very good ash. Storm assault, top tier, it's on the cliff side. We'll grab it at some point in the future. We're gonna go back and do a lot of content that we skip um, later on in this playthrough. Or instructional video of sorts. But for now, uh, it's not urgent. Pots are useful though. And it's nice to raise our maximum number. Is this the one from the, I think it, oh, this one is. Yeah, we won't be using that. Yeah, we're here, we'll do this. This is not a very focused video. Let's go up here. We will not speak of this. Happens at least once for playthrough though. We're just paying our taxes. Actually, grab. Well, not here, here, but in a moment, we will be grabbing some some things. Okay, so there's oh no, the tree nest lily. All right, it's good to stock up on those because we will be using them later in the playthrough. Godskin bosses are obnoxious, to say the least. She's lovely. The tower shield down here that uh, no one ever uses.
Ominous garb. Uh, is it only the simple garb or any garb that ups your faith? We won't be using it at the moment. Okay, it d all of them ups your faith. Up your faith. Yeah, for some reason there's a distinction between the normal and simple versions, despite the fact that they do the same thing. It looks slightly different, I guess. You can use it uh, for certain bosses, but right now I think uh, the defenses are much more important. My anyway, shortcut opened. Easy as pie. And here we go. Let's go kill the boss! Right now, uh, faith requirements are not a huge thing. It will be later when we're trying to carry uh, heavier light game weapons. But that's for PvP. Right now, we're just doing some PvE action. Yeah, bathed and raise it gold. I hear ya. I hear ya. But consider this. See if he gets rotted. He might not. It's not a huge issue if he doesn't. Stick close to his ass as a missed the repost. Got the bleed. Spin right to him. Everybody knows this by now, I hope. good at all. I think we live this though. He actually hit me with that. There we go. Easy as pie. No upgrades. Remember, we don't need those things. We have busted ashes of war. We didn't even use Flame of the Red Mains. We didn't even do that. And, uh... He went down easy. All right, keep that in mind, folks. Keep that in mind. Now, it used to be that if you uh, didn't go back to talk to GP for Gostock, you would screw yourself over for a, a hot minute because you can't buy some of his items. You know, if you want his buckler. Um, fortunately for us, that is they fixed that bug. Uh, so you can actually buy from him here. And remember, we don't kill Geekkeeper Gostock. We don't do that. We don't do that here. Even if he is an asshole. He's an asshole with a buckler and three silver pickled foul feet. Think about that. Think about what you're done. Okay? So keep that in mind.
We have a bunch of souls now. Um, we could be spending this on uh, buying up corn stock. Um, I highly recommend that. We could also go um, go around to some of the merchants we've been skipping out on and buying their goods. Also recommended. So I think we'll do that in a second here. But uh, that's uh, that's everything important in Limgrave. Cleared out. Easy as pie. Not very fast. But uh, not that hard either. Unfortunate thing about the Shirira grapes, uh, we were not completing Hayata's quest line. We will not be doing that. Which frustrates me, because, you know, it's nice to have the, uh, the no requirement. But it's not as nice as you think. Because the only thing it really does is let you cast uh, Catch Flame without a uh, Talisman on. Uh, slightly more effectively. It doesn't actually do all that much besides. I know. I know. Distressing to think of. Distressing. Absolutely distressing. But it's, uh, it's the grim reality. It's the grim reality. Okay, so let's go to this isolated merchant. Let's get his Lost Ashes. We probably won't use that for 5 million years, but... You know, keep that thing on you. Um, what we really will need, however, is some more stone sword keys. Uh, we will not be using that on this character just because we have low endurance, but we could get the lost ashes. Go by the invasion fingers if you want to do some early invasions. I'm not doing it uh, for now. Um, let's go to the bridge merchant. We'll get his crack pot. We can go to the Kaled merchant as well. Get his crack pot. And we'll save the rest for, for Bogart probably. We want at least a thousand six hundred. So you can buy the prawn and the uh, memento. Friendo! Let's see what you got. Alright, Halberd, very good. Pot, very good. Magic Warriors Cookbook, very good. Oh, speaking of, let's do, actually, actually, now's a great time to do box quest line, because we can go to the uh, Coastal Merchant, get what he has to offer. We'll get that after we uh, visit El Merchanto. Like, there's a couple merchants around here in Kaled that uh, we should go visit. Raison being... One of them gives us the Rot Cookbook. Which is, uh... Which is more than occasionally useful. Once again, I, I do not... I do not recommend using Rot on other players. I think it's kind of rude. Um, especially things like Rot Breath. However, PvE, absolutely required. Okay, so this gives us the Rot. It was a Crackpot. Um, we will save right now on the Stone Sword Key. Because I want to go find the other merchant in this area. Around here somewhere. Crab eggs. What are they doing here? I think if you... There's like two merchants around here somewhere. Kind of funky. But yeah, we should find... Just like a stray from... Caleb South or something? Straight from the highway. Ah, there you are. Merchanto. Rob boluses. Well, that's tempting. That's tempting. There's also some alien butterflies if you need them. 
not gonna buy it right now, but we'll be back for them eventually. Should be grace up here somewhere. There it is. So yeah, keep that in mind. It will be useful. Just uh, not for not for this character. Is that a? Oh, uh, this is the one for life steal fist. don't really need that but we have it now okay so that's one merchant there's a merchant up here as well we could go grab um we could do we could start on the gary quest line but i think we can wait for that okay bach it's uh it's time to go help our friend out we've been putting it off well, that's just too darn cruel and uh it's, it's another quest line we can just advance for at no cost to ourselves. And we won't be able to make poison boluses. Although we'll be making scant use of that fact. Uh, they're the real one, Bach. He gives us mushrooms too. Alright, off to visit Kale. What you got for us, my man? Um, bone arrows. We don't really need the cured meat at the moment, but bone arrows is nice. We could buy the telescope. We could buy the torch. Frankly, unnecessary at the moment. Off we go to the beach. And I know, I know, we can hold off on most of this stuff. It's quite true. But uh, we're being thorough here. Well, semi-thorough. We could let's let's go grab the Ash of War just because it's a pain. Oh my goodness! I'm getting trolled out here. Grab the most useful Ash of War. Ah, oh, goo. Got goofed. Stamp sweep. Hardly than necessary. We'll be taking it with us anyhow. I like to grab the uh, the skulls. Oh, that's a rune fragment. Bamboozled again. But the skulls are nice, just for just as loose change, you know. It's like keeping quarters on you. Required. Oh, that's right. We're gonna shop from Corwin. That's right. Um, let's just grab that for now. Grab, grab the uh, round shield. But we can hold off on that. We do want a bow. This tends to be useful, so we'll grab that. And like forty arrows. Doesn't have to be so hurt about it. Gosh. Well, we'll grab the golden cow foot. We don't really need the runes, but once we unlock a few things in the shop, we we'll always find a way to spend spare runes. Bolses usually. Of course, we have uh, 
in the present moment, most of our runes are going to go to buying Ashes of War from uh, Bernal. Again, these are crafting equipment, so on and so forth. Could buy a spell slot as well. It might be the time to do so, since we'll be picking up Flame Cleanse Me pretty soon. It's one of those uh, always keep on you, Ashes of War. Oh, Bach, what did they do to you? Little well, baby boobop. Alright. For this, we're gonna whip out the katana. Lantern. Can't bear to hear the pain no more. Be unlucky. Right, these bozos. Oh, a falchion and string. I mean, string's more valuable. Let's not let's not kid ourselves. So let's top off. Uh, we could always summon a friend. We don't have to. Honestly, we're not gonna. This is what we mean by. Look at that. Look at that damage. Emotional damage. It's that easy. Church of Dragon Communion? Uh, we ain't going there. We already have it for the other one. We don't need to. And uh, we don't need to kill all these defenseless creatures. Though we could. But yeah. Uh, this is why this is why we keep us the misericordia on us. Let's talk to Bach. Bach, we got your stuff back. Oh, baby, booba. There you go, bub. Go uh, talk to Corwin. Get that uh, magic defense. Magic fort spell, maybe. We gotta get that at some point. Or PvP. Get the incantations. Magic fort. Although, we could just save for Mariel. With the Black Flame. Um, we don't need any of these. Go. Arsenal charm acquired. We won't be using it at any point just because we can get a better one. But for those of you who want something in the interim, I highly suggest picking it up. Alright, we'll grab that memory stone. We'll be on our way. We have enough for the Raya stuff. Let's go. Bach only shows up around certain hours of the day, so don't feel disappointed if it's not here. He'll show up. We could talk to Thop. Or we could not talk to Thop. But we do want to grab. Well, I don't know if we really want to grab this. 
honestly, at this point, the uh, Sacred Tears are ceasing to have any effect. Even if you've got the uh, Elbenerk head on, it's not going to change much. And we will be putting that on. Um, that will be the face of our Faith Twink. At least uh, while we're doing PvE. Because we need that uh, small bonus to Arcane. This cookbook. Lovely. We can ignore everything else. Are we buying anything from the merchant? Uh, we can buy uh, a stock maybe. But we're saving our money so we can always come back for this. It's close to the edge. Oh, right, right. The astrologer gloves. Okay, hear me out. But the astrologer gloves are uh, one of the best gloves if you're tight on weight. Because it gives you poise for like 1.7. Which, ratio-wise, it's terrible. But in terms of how little weight you're getting and still getting some poise and defense, um, it's really good. And it's good for light rolling as well. I know, maybe it's just my Dark Souls 3 mindset, but I like to always have something in a slot. Alright. We should jump up. There we go. Now, there's a lot of ways to do this zone. Um, faster ways, slower ways. We'll be going pretty slow, I think. We're not speedrunning this. But we'll grab the ritual pot here. We'll grab this uh, teleporter. But we're gonna go back because we want to talk to Raya. Uh, we could do the jump skip, but I think we're not going to do the jump skip here. We're actually going to sprint through the town, because that way we can go grab the um, the seed more reliably. We do want the seed. The seed. There's also a, a wooden shield back here that a lot of people like for fashion. Could always stick uh, retaliation on it or something but we'll end up changing our armor fashion at some point so it's a thing there is a charge fourth i think ash of war down here somewhere which we will be dutifully ignoring for the moment but we want to jump onto that rooftop like so which will drop us right by the seed isn't that nice? Then we can make our way over to the um, set of grace that's over here somewhere. I don't know, we are out there somewhere. Somewhere you return again to me. Um, there it is. And of course, the map. Isn't that convenient? Um, we have the wrap. Okay, we'll just mark the locations because I get lost easily, you see. It's the scenic isle, I think. The shacks like here. Oh, uh, no need that many. But we will take that path next. Then after that, we're going to go get uh, the fingerprint. Or sorry, the uh, two fingers heirloom. Because it's really good. Um, it'll take our faith over 20, which means we can naturally cast Black Fire, Black Flame. I don't know how much we'll be using it early game, but, you know, 20 is a nice, um, semi-soft cap for a lot of things. It'll open us up for various, uh, requirements. I 
I hate that the jumping does that. I mean, I'm glad they put a barrier there, but it's kind of obnoxious. All right, so Patches should have moved over here. Don't worry about the uh, the chest. All it contains is a bear. Ignore it. We shall ignore it. In fact, we won't even speak to Patches here, although he has some new goods in stock, I believe. Because we don't have the dough at the moment. He will speak of the, uh, the Iron Maiden, Iron Virgin, and the um, and Raya. And people still hate him for some reason. Dude, he's being helpful. What can I say? We could even go after the uh, Death Rite Bird around here. Death Bird. I'm not sure which one it is. It's around here, though. Easy souls, if we want to do it. And it is night. Okay. Uh, precious boy. Purchase one prime. Such a shame that you don't. Oh yeah, and then you get the spread out uh, gesture that way. Such a shame that they didn't make it so uh, by you know, starting with prime would make it so it's just friendly tea from the start. Like it's not a huge mechanical difference, but I, I wish that was the case. Ooh, that's uh, <laughs> twenty percent. No, we won't do that. Um, item crafting. Let's get this pots. We'll max out on pots. Throw that on here and uh, go hunting. Cause why not? We're falling out of runes. I think uh, the, it's right here. I don't know if you can summon for this fight. Oh, wait. This is not the place. I mean, that's not the place because there's a giant freaking lobster up here. Let's leave. Push taste. I don't think you can summon. The only reason I, I bring it up is because, um... What the? Am I going crazy? Oh, is it way over here? It's probably this one. Curses. Oh, we'll sprint on over there. There's some uh, Trina's lilies around here somewhere as well, like three of them. Uh, oh, that's right. We have the viral quest line to begin. We could do that as well. There's a hundred things to do. This is why we're not do doing it quickly. It's not a speed run. It's not a skip everything we don't need to do run. Okay, I think this is the spot. Let's not forget to use the ash or uh, use the physic. Let's stay topped off. And easy victory. This is the power of cheese. And we get the, oh, the Red Feathered Brain Sword. Uh, we're not going to really use that, especially on this certain character. But if you want to be that guy, you know, that guy, um, this is a great way to, um, how do you say, um, get two cracked, uh, or two uh, ruptured physics, ruptured tier physics, and, uh, blow yourself up and kill people. I'm pretty sure the Red Branch Sword affects others, because you know, you take 700 self damage. Oh, there's the lilies. Well, yeah, you can absolutely demolish a level of phantoms if they're not blocking, which, you know, they usually are, but <laughs> behind their fingerprint shields. But if they're not, you can, uh, you can eliminate them in one hit. 
does take you to the consecrated snowfields, but guess where we're going? That's right, we're going to go to the consecrated snowfields. Not for maybe a couple weeks, but we will. Let's grab the set of grace, because this is the convenient one. And then we'll go read Vara's message. So he can give us the quest line. Uh, and then we'll go get the academy key, I think. Wait, why am I going here? I goofed. Uh, anything we want to grab while we're here? I don't think so. All right, so let's go to first step. Vare should have left us a message we can read, and then we can go to the the church. Go to church, folks. Oh, right. We have to uh, talk to the two fingers first. That's what it was. So I was right all along. What are we doing here? One viewers. Is it a bot? Are you a bot, dear viewer? Asking the real questions. We can actually get a faith weapon here, by the way. Uh, it'll cost some runes, so we might not grab it. Uh, only 2,000? You know what? Let's just grab it. Uh, if we two-hand it, we can use the Grafted Dragon, or if we get the... Uh, we can actually wield it immediately if we go get the uh, Talisman. Never use this weapon on any of my other low level characters, this would be fun. Since we're here, why not? No. Take care of some business. And grab a gesture while we're at it, right? This is a little secret technique. Start chugging here. Oh. Two can missed. There's the bleep. And it's that easy, folks. It's that easy. This is why the Uchi is so Gucci. And I, uh, oh, I promise never to say that again. Uh, we can use the Safer Pata um, as soon as we get the Heirloom by drinking Physic, but I don't I don't recommend it. Like, yeah, you can keep it on you, but what's the point? It's a little slow to be cutting through shields with its weapon art. I guess you know, it's not like we're going to stick it on any other character. So, might as well grab it. This is what the Faith playthrough is for, after all. Are we going to turn the Taunter's Tongue on here? Uh, I think not. I think not at all. Let's, um, you know, I'll, I'll go grab the, the two fingers uh, heirloom. Because, 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 uh, 20 faith is a great breakpoint. And we'll be hitting 21. At least. Um, eastward. Yes. Of course, if you're doing like the Hayata quest line, you'd need to go visit over here. We are not, however, doing the Hayata quest line. Because it is impossible. 
You cannot do it if you want to keep you in the blow. Darn dog. They're weak to fire. Barely need the sidearm at this point. Although once we start worrying about our carry weight, it will be relevant that it weighs so low. All right, the two f two fingers are low. We're gonna just swap that out. Partially, I think it increases their flat resistances. Yeah. See, look, our flat uh, damage. Her flat defense went up by two points. All right, so that's part of the power of uh, straight up set boosts. It's an IQ boost your defenses. Not as much, however, as uh, putting out the ritual shield talisman, which we will be obtaining and using uh, in the late game. Let's go grab the grace and then uh okay i think then we get the key then we get the key we eventually do what we set out to do just takes us uh half an hour or so oh wait 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 sorry one more thing columbus style just one more thing way up here we can obtain the uh, tree spear which is a faith weapon. And in a little bit, we'll go and fight Vike. And of course, Vike will drop us his great spear, which is going to be better than the tree spear, not in terms of damage, but, uh, you know, in terms of uh, disgusting weapon art, disgusting stats build up, and has lower requirements. I think you only need to wear the prosthesis wearer's heirloom to wear it on this. On this character which is um, quite nice it also doesn't weigh all that much so overall a very uh, very strong option time will tell if it's a little too disgusting to use but for now we're gonna go grab the tree spear that will be in our arsenal Okay, you done incurred my wrath. I'll have to teach you a thing or two about repost damage. And stagger looping. Can't stagger loop. Not sure what happened there. But 
the beast was slain. Once again, I wasted my time on something absolutely unnecessary. Oakley Dogley, let's get over. Let's get down to business. Get the dragon's key. Of course, we can also uh, go talk to Dare while we're here, directly west from these ruins. It's on the way. It's on the way. We're definitely not wasting our time here. Hello, Vare. We will do that in a minute. I guess I could have used the dagger if it's staggerable like that. Well, no need. And of course, an excellent location to farm the blood roses. Which can be crafted into some really nice grease to add to the flat bleed on a katana. We may be using that for Ranala. Almost certainly, in fact. Around here, there is some loot. Is it here? Yeah. I think it's the hatchet. Yes. I believe we can wield that. Maybe. We don't have enough decks, it's not a huge loss. We aren't going to use it. This ain't. Uh, this isn't release. This isn't the release patch. Uh, we have a better frost ash in this area to obtain. That's right. I said a better frost ash. So we will be doing that a little bit later. We will not be fighting the dragon for obvious reasons. We're just going to uh, zoom on by. There we go. We just go uh, over this way and grab the ash, or uh, we can grab the set of grace beyond. This will save us some trips later. And this is a great way to go over to uh, Bellum Church, which we will be doing. Because after we do our invasions, we're going to be asked to uh, grab the blood of a finger maiden. I mean, we could do the new quest line. Actually, we might just choose to do the new quest line. Uh, and we can go to Altus for that. You know, it's free It's free stuff, right? You get a great stars. Not sure if we're going to use great stars, but it's, it's free stuff. We don't say no to good stuff. Uh, this is not a bad location to get ourselves some stuff. But I think we want to go over to Muriel in a bit because we have some souls. We can get the Black Fire Incantation. And we don't have that many of these as souls. Maybe burn all. But we can always do some Volcano Manor quests with them to get that.
You can also head over to Carry Manor. There's an option. What it's uh. No, we'll we'll do that. Since we have the glintstone, we can always go to Bellum Church by the highway. It's a little faster. We're gonna take the rune stream precipice at some point, but we don't have to do it right now. Doesn't make a huge difference either way. Oh, and we have to give back the locket to Raya. Because she's cutie pie. And we want to protect that smile. You know, like a simp. Um. Most people like to jump on the cliff. I do not like to do that. So we will not. That's all there is to uh, say about this. We could buy the uh, Carrion Felgree crest here. I don't think we are. 25% is not as good. Um, we can always come back and buy this. Well, we can't talk to EG if you want. Let's chill. I had to get through a lot of things to say, Blade sent me. Alright, and there we go. He says that. Uh, we might as well go up here and get a frost ash. Not the one we wanted. We could even uh, challenge. Um, what's her name? L Loretta? Loretta! Now and then. Oh, we don't get copyright struck. Good song, though. I'll we'll swap to not Storm Stomp, but the next best thing for taking these out. Uh, we could also grab the It Not out over here it's useful for certain kinds of farm we probably won't be doing it on needing it on this character but there we go acquired and where do we go into the academy we go or we just head straight to church good child Well, we might as well kill the dog, though. I don't know. Oh, that's right. We can go to Bella from here. It's quite urgent, in fact. All right, and we had we had to go talk to Ryan as well. That's right. Oh, we could also uh, we could also do Eura's quest. We can progress that, and we can get another seed over here. So I guess that's something to take up, take care of uh, immediately. Easy to miss. Oh, we didn't talk to Yura actually, so he's not here yet. Shame. We had to talk to Yura uh, after the uh, invasion. So I guess that's something uh, else we can progress. 
we'll grab some graces and then we'll do that. It's easy to forget a lot of things uh, in this game, but you know, make a checklist, I guess, before anything irrevocable happens. And for heaven's sake, don't go around killing NPCs. I mean, you can do what you want, but that will occasionally lock you out of things that are marginal, but like, it's free stuff, you know? Bellum Church is over here somewhere. The lift is over here. We're not taking the lift yet. We're not taking the lift yet. We don't do that. We don't do that here. Not before we talk to Snake Girl. She can tell us to the Volcano Manor. It's more convenient that way. More sacred tears that mean nothing to us, but we like to see those numbers go up, so. We'll upgrade. They do not affect matchmaking. And I, for one, am grateful. Uh, but we'll grab the side of grace up there. Because uh, that makes it convenient if we mess up. And just hug the uh, left, we can avoid the trebuchets for the most part. I think we can jump up that cliff there. Bike is a pain, a royal pain, but nothing impossible to take care of, especially since we've got our flasks uh, upgraded quite a bit. I'm not sure you can repost them normally. Um, I think it's treated as a player. So, this will get us closer to the to the maiden we need. I mean, we could always take the other route. Oh gosh. We can grab the grace. We could even be brave. Actually, don't be brave. Be safe. Oh! I screwed up. This is why we get the uh, the lift grace. Don't be like me. Not be like me. We could have bought the uh, rift shield if we really wanted to. I think. Or is yeah? I think the rift shield is sold by the merchant down uh, south of Film Church. That would improve our focus. It is what it is. We'll uh, hug the left here. 
I think that gets us under cover better. Not be mauled by dogs this time. We can grab the grace. I said we don't need to be mauled by dogs this time. No! Did we go too far. We went too far. <clears throat> we won't talk about this. Death is okay. Just remember that. Death is okay. Make it a mantra. It's how you'll survive Souls games. Although, I mean, anyone who's watching this is probably, probably uh, as experienced as I am. At least in terms of playing the game. Okay, we won't go up on the on top, we'll go this way. That way we should be able to find the location of the grace. Plus taste. There it is. We'll grab our runes real fast. And we are way too low. That's the issue. I'm gonna rest up. I'm gonna take out the tower. We're gonna take out the tower. I've had enough of that nonsense. I have Sauron nonsense. Our Sauron powered by Amazon Prime. It's canonical now. We will punish the hubris. I they can see me up there. Okay. It's driving me crazy. This is unironically harder than most of the demigods. The major bosses in this game. Wait, wait, wait. Ah, oh, I died. Maybe I'll craft some bombs. I don't know. But for real, this is just one of the most difficult sections of the game. No joke. Let's see if we can't hide here. Oh, 
Oh gosh. No, that didn't work. The madness beer. Yeah, there it goes. We'll just climb. Fuck this. That's the answer. No! I'm freaking believable. Kevin this up. Okay, let's do this carefully. Set the meter. This is frustrating in the extreme. There you go. Finally, good lord. And this is and this is about the end of my seven-page essay on why we're not. I'm not going to watch the uh, the new Lord of the Rings series on Amazon. Thank you for coming to my TED talk. Uh, there is a rise around here in there. Uh, we will ignore it for the minute. Oh, we missed.
missed it. Ah, whatever. It shall not matter. We can always come back. But yeah, that uh, the hood we're wearing made a, a big difference, didn't it? I should have. I should have taken a swig as well. I'll do so now. Aren't you gonna sprint past? We want to grab the grace. Always grab the grace. That way your mistakes can become useful mistakes. Go now. I don't know if he can be poisoned, but it's worth trying. Us. I didn't think it's gonna do how. At times like these, we can turn to consumables to make our task easier. That's right, that polygraph is familiar. We know he, uh, I think he bleeds. If he bleeds, we can't kill him. It's a bit of a joke, but uh, it is true. It takes a minute for him to register. They should invade us. by the spear. Typical net code, even in a PvP fight or PvE fight. Keep that in mind. <sighs> yeah, it's kind of bullshit. Part of my language. It's not a fun fight, that low level. I wonder if we can swap to say hatchet here um we do not have the decks required okay never mind then i don't think we actually get any benefit from poison i'm not even sure we get any benefit from blood but we'll two hand this Let's see where it goes we could have put spin slash on this maybe Oh, 
are you gonna give me? Rain needs to be in green. You think the uh, the mind on on a, on a prophet would really help with this, but apparently not. Um, we'll swap this out for the prawn we have. And maybe throw in some cooker balloon stones since we're here. We're gonna we're gonna do a random BS go strategy. Should appear. I promise this is possible. Might just be bad uh, weapon choice here. Regardless, uh, we'll keep doing it for a while. I swear it gets easier. Get more slots. Is is actually invisible. Oh, there it is. No, the tracking. I'm gonna have to come back with something a little bit more usable, like a pole line. Wait, we have a pole line though. Just a moment. Am I being silly here? Um, Ashes of War. I think we're being silly here. Um, we could put flame slash on there. I think I'll do it, and we'll just keep it on standard. And we can do heavy. There we go. To die as often as one pleases. That's right. I really don't like the tracking on that spell in particular. I'm gonna be honest, I'm not having a good time. But uh, you gotta get used to it. I, I swear it gets better, I swear it gets better. We don't have the uh, the best setup yet.
gets to backdash that? What is this, DS2? Oh, it is. What, can we? I think we can keep him from using flask. No. Is that not enough? There we go. Yeah, halberds are the PV, PVE, uh, not PVE, PV, how to say, against NPCs that are like player characters, halberds are really good just because they, they're free poise break. And now we have something that we don't have the decks for, but we're very darn close to having the decks for. One talisman away. All right, and we've got a lot of runes. See, it's worth it. It's worth it. You'll become strong. Okay. Uh, and I'm sorry for, well, not really that sorry because this is basically PvP in terms of the mechanics of it. But I'm sorry I said the PvE flame slash isn't so good. Here's our use case, and what a good use case it is. Okay. Yeah, we were putting stop. Let's go talk to Raya. Precious little baby ride. And then we can go to Volcano Manor. Um, and buy stuff for Bernal. Actually, if we want to buy stuff for Bernal, we better do it now. Because he doesn't sell until you do your first mission. Not a huge issue. But we're going to run into the, the same situation. Uh, maybe we'll go kill Bernala. Or maybe we'll cut the stream. It's getting... A little warm in my room. I'm getting a little tired. Eh, it's not a huge issue. Yeah, make sure to talk to your NPCs. All right. Um, do we want to do anything before we go to Altus? Yeah, there are a few things, so we're not going to do that yet. But we've got it. We've got it set up. That's what matters. Uh, I think we're going to go visit Turtle Pope in a minute. Um, in a hot minute. Tell you what. We'll cut the stream here. And just uh, spend our souls. Spend our runes. Uh, sparing enough for Blackfire Incantation. And go like that. The incantations. Oh yeah, that's right. We already got all the incantations we want from him. All right. Well, we'll just cut it here then. Take care, folks. Thanks for watching. Um, there we go. Bye bye.